pre-post-test eighth grade English language arts. Part one, poetry. Please read the poem, He Had His Dream by Paul Lawrence Dunbar and answer the following questions. He had his dream and all through life, worked up to it through toil and strife. A float for air before his eyes, it colored for him all his skies. The storm cloud dark above his bark, the calm and listless vault of blue took on its hopeful hue. It tinctured every passing beam. He had his dream. He labored hard and failed at last, his sails too weak to bear the blast. The raging tempest tore away and sent his beating bark astray. But what cared for he for wind or sea? He said, the tempest will be short. My bark will come to port. He saw through every cloud of gleam. He had his dream. Why does the poem keep saying he had his dream? A, to have rhyme. B, to empathize a theme. Or C, to tell what the man thought. D, to explain what happened. Number two, why does the poem say storm cloud dark? A, the man was sad. B, the sky was cloudy. C, the man faced problems. D, the man was worried. Number three, what does it mean when the poet says he saw through every cloud a gleam? A, he was discouraged. B, he was patient. C, he had hope. Not gonna read choice D, I'm gonna start eliminating a choice. Okay, so the one I don't read means don't pick that one. Number four, why does the poet write about difficulties? A, to show that hard work can fail. B, to help people think about problems. D, to encourage people to try. Number five, what is the rhyme scheme of the poem? Is it A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B? Or B, is it A, A, B, B, C, C, D, D, E, E? Is it C, A, B, B, C, A, B, B, C, A, B? Or is it not gonna read that one? Number six, the poem is written in A, couplets, B, quatrains, C, cinquains, or D, triplets. Match the correct literary term with the correct example. So you have all these literary terms. A simile is A, a metaphor is B, onomatopoeia is C, D is personification, E is alliteration, A, B is rhyme scheme, A, C is rhyme. Number seven, the trees are crying aloud. The trees are crying aloud. Is it, which one of those is it? Trees crying. Number eight, the mouse beneath the stone is still as death. Still as death. Number nine, life is, is a broken winged bird. Number 10, chirp, tweet. Number 11, flickering, flittering, fireflies. Number 12, light and night. Number 13, I went to the market to buy a pair. I made a mistake and forgot to share. Okay, look at your options. You shouldn't have repeated any letters here. So no letter options should be repeated. All right. 